So when the devil was created, yeah. when the Satan or the Lucifer, whatever yeah. you want to call yeah, him, yeah, yeah, yeah. or the Iblis, when he was created, he wasn't created evil. No, great. Agreed? Agreed. So don't say God creates evil next time. No, 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 no. I'm no, not don't saying even, that. You allows, asked me that question. He, no, he allows for evil. Yeah, there's a difference between what? creating as evil yeah. and allowing allowing the people to okay. choose their so own free will yeah. yes. to okay. choose between so good and bad. Good. Yeah. So no one no one says God creates evil. Oh, it is by their own free will yes. that they choose to do good yes. or choose to do evil. So good, however, yeah. however, the Bible in chapter 2, Corinthians chapter 4, Verse 4, it says uh, the, the Satan is the Lord of this world. At the moment. Yes. Lord. Lord means God. Yes. Do you agree? No, not God. In okay. the Bible, there's if only Jesus... one God. There's an L with a small underscore with a lowercase L. There's no lowercase in Hebrew or, or, are, or Greek. There's a hierarchy. There's no, there's there's no lowercase. Or up, there's no lowercase in Hebrew or in, in Greek. Satan is not almighty. When you are the ruler of the world and Jesus is not, do you agree? Wait, wait, wait. Jesus said, this, king, this world is not of my kingdom. But the the, yes. the same Jesus, yeah. the same Jesus in so, 2 Corinthians so, 4, 4, so Satan is, wait, wait, the same Jesus Satan, says Satan is the ruler of the world. Can I Jesus say, is not the ruler of the world, Satan is. What I'm saying is, yeah. theology-wise, Christian is saying there's two kingdoms, and you're right, Satan was originally an angel of light. He was an angel of light, but he fell because he chose the path of his own power and his own glory. So he chose, as you're right, my friend, to to go his own way yeah. and he fell the from, path to darkness he so, found that yeah. so, so now he is at the moment the, whether we like it or not the kingdom of darkness is ruled by satan however the kingdom of darkness has already lost the battle with the kingdom of light so at this point we're saying that jesus has the greater power but not 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 the whole kingdom of light hasn't had enough time for people to make their decision. You know, earlier I asked you, what is your definition of the kingdom of darkness? It's the rule, it's this world. So are we still in this world? We are still, but it's now and not yet. My focus is, there's two kingdoms in power. Also, uh, now, now, are we there's in the king kingdom? Okay, now, right there's now, right now, are you in the kingdom of darkness or not? There's two kingdoms. I'm waiting for your I'm answer. I'm not going to give you my... That's, I'm waiting for your answer. I don't have to say where I live. Why? Yeah? Because Why? I, that's my privacy. Also, you're, you're talking about the evils in your life. I'm not talking about that. No, 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 no. I'm talking about the evils in this world. You know, today, listen to me. Since the time of Jesus, has evil increased in this world or decreased? Yeah, and it will carry on. No, no, I want an answer from you. Has it increased there or decreased? There will be a time of great tribulation. Has the evil increased or decreased? But what's the point of your My question? point, I'll get to it. First, yeah. you answer the question. I can't say if it's increasing or not. I, I think we say... can. We can. If you look at the amount of pornography today compared to 2,000 years ago, yeah. if you look at the amount of sins that are committed, yeah. not only online, yeah. but offline as well, yeah, when, when today there is no more shame, you know, people yeah, yeah, yeah. Are, are, are sinning left, right and center. Well, In fact, yeah. Jesus' crucifixion had no impact. It, the sin actually increased. He was supposed to come to defeat the devil, yeah. but the devil has got stronger. The devil has been defeated. Right? No, it hasn't. On the cross, in fact, he's got stronger in your, and no, not defeated. In your, in your worldview, he hasn't been. In mine. But you agreed with Jesus, me that, that, no, no, Jesus that sin increased. The, no, it may be. Okay, so how did the devil get defeated? Go on, tell me. On the cross. How? Okay. Make sure you say how the devil is defeated, I'll not how you, Jesus paid I'll for your you sins. Because I already know that narrative. I'll tell you how. How did Satan get defeated? Can I, That's can what I answer? Yeah, go on. How do I... So, access to the Father, yeah? God has already judged the world. And you know how he judged the world? He poured all of that judgment onto his son. Jesus has taken the full punishment, that whole of humanity. God has no more judgment left. It's been spent and it was spent on Jesus. Now Jesus went to death, but because he was sinless, death couldn't hold on to him and he had life. I don't have to be perfect because he is. I already have access to the Father. How did the faith? Satan get defeated? You haven't answered that. You haven't even touched because, upon it. Yeah, because Satan can't stop me getting to the Father now. He has no jurisdiction. How did he me. get defeated? That was the question. Well, I've just told you. No, you haven't. Be. You said how you will reach, how, you get, how you're getting atonement by the human sacrifice of Jesus. So Satan has no power over me. No, but how did Jesus... He's defeated. Wait, wait. So before, before this, yeah. before your atonement, yeah. could you have committed sins? I still commit sins. Thank you. So Jesus didn't do anything then? No, he has because I'm forgiven. 
I oh, have no wait, judgment wait. for my sin. So you're saying that whatever sin you do, you'll be forgiven. Yeah. But I don't do it deliberately. I, I I'm asking you a question. Being. Listen. So, yeah. If you commit a sin deliberately, are you forgiven? Yes. There you go. So, there you go. Oh, yes. so what is the point? Hallelujah that we're forgiven. So if you Hallelujah, good news. The gospel is good news. Actually, that is good news for the rapists, you're right. And for the murderers yeah, who are Christians. <laughs>